comedy store all day, every day. I told you we go Africa, the king herself. And my name is Alex Mhanji. I've made it, man. See, look at me. <laughs> All right, let's gonna begin with you. Cindy, how are you? I'm good. Good how to are have you? you. Thank you. I'm excited to be back. You're welcome. Yes. You're, wel you're welcome. Thank uh, you. Yeah, you're really back. <laughs> Thank you. Do you notice there's a man from Nigeria? Yes, there is. Clean to the drunk. What's <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> up, Clean? How are you? I want to pee. Yeah. <laughs> you want to go for a shako? Mm? Yeah. You want to pee? Mm. Right Not now? Not chocolate. There's, I don't like chocolate when I'm peeing. Yeah. It attracts ants. <laughs> and, and it's just. Where do, where, okay. We are going after here, yeah, after the interview. Okay. Yeah, how are you killing the drive? It depends on where I am. <laughs> here you're backstage. At comedy backstage, store. I like it from the back. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Have you noticed there's Cinderella in no the need. Yeah. I'm just waiting for this interview to be over. And then you can attack. Without fear. <laughs> so that's what's up. We're here. How do you feel about, uh, by the way, the environment? I know you've not been on stage yet. How do I feel? I need a doctor's report for that because I don't know. You know, sometimes you feel good, yeah. but at the end of the day, you feel like there's a palpitation in your abdomen, making you to have a dichotlidomical attraction in, in a contractive Endocrine. Exactly. I get Why it. Why are you saying exactly? What do you understand what I say? <laughs> <laughs> Cindy, you went, you read more books, you should translate. For me. No, not that English, no. I need to study drunk. Yeah? Yes. Do you know the drunk? Have you watched him before? I have watched him on YouTube. You, you told me your mom is a big fan. Yes, Tell she is. She's here, she's right there oh, in wait. yellow. Oh. Oh, mommy, come here. She came all the way to me, mommy. Mommy yeah. came to watch Clean. Please tell me my, my yes. mother in law was here. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this yes. is Cindy's mom. <laughs> she came all the way from Mumbale oh to God. come and uh, watch. <laughs> How are you, man? I'm okay. How do you feel right now that the man of your dreams is happy? I really wanted to see him. I feel good. Ah. You, see, you see, I am. I'm, I'm so happy. Yeah. There's no need for you. I can't go for anymore. Yeah. By their hair, you shall know them. <laughs> The drug is in the building, and of course, uh, Cindy's mom says, I need to go and see Clint. You can go back home now because no, yeah. I have to watch him. I'm going home with them. <laughs> so, the daughter, the mom is here. So, introduction that's how we do it. Yes, I have my you stop it. Yeah. That's in Lost First Auntie. She's around there too. So, we'll just do the family this thing, and we are, we are done. Anyway, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna go and go and do a show. Your Cindy is coming on, doing uh, you know with band Cindy live, and of course, Clint the drunk is also gonna come on. That's what's up. Comedy store all day, every day. The family is still going on. Mm. All right, that's what's up. Say hi to the fans there. Just wave. Hi right to there. the fans there. Just wave. Yeah. That's what you told me to say. Ladies and gentlemen, ew, 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 ew. Comedy store, are you ready? Help me welcome, all the way from Nigeria, the man himself, Clint the Drug! Power of command. Power of command. If you can command anything in this world, you are a commander. If you can command the way I command, you're not just a commander, you're a comrade. That means you can communicate. Let me show you. Again. Even if I don't want to use my whole hand, I can use remote control. Watch. Uh, I, <laughs> now let me show you another level of command that you don't know about. It's called an elevative dichotledrum in an epidemical elevation. Don't shout, I don't know what it means. <laughs> Watch what I mean. Funky, fire, motor, liquid. I attend the tetem. Oh, mama tetem. Tipo, tipo tetem. I attend the tetem. Mama tetem. Shuka chini tetem. My brother, you made it to the show. You're welcome. 
Wow, are you traveling from here? Because I can see you're wearing your bag. <laughs> can pull a guy here on your shirt. Just wear the whole. You know, I know you. Every show I go, I see you. <laughs> Every show. I, and you made it this time, you made it to the VIP. Okay. No, this is this VIP. To, okay, to the IP. <laughs> you can make some noise. I love this country. I love this country. Please put your hands together for yourself. You deserve it. Honestly. Then put your hands together for Alex because he did a wonderful job. Clap for that man. And put your hands together for God for making it possible. One, only two people will go to heaven from here. Two people will make it to heaven. Because I say clap for yourself. Well, maybe you don't like yourself. And I say clap for the man that made it possible. You people clapped, but you paid. So the clap is not as much as the payment. I understand. Clap for God. You now decide. Don't, don't, if you clap now, you, you have your, you have break your hand in 14 places. I say clap for God. You and God, not the same mate. Are you the same age? Are you on the same level? Are you on the same class? And you had the courage to sit down and clap for God. But if it's president that enter, you stand up. Do you want to see December? Do you want to be alive till December? Do you want to make it in life? Life? Okay, then when I say clap for God, don't worry. If I say clap for God, sit down and clap. Don't worry. By this is what? June. By October, you'll be looking for yourself. Watch it. Now put your hands together for God Almighty. Anybody sitting down will not make it till December. I promise you that. Put your hands together for God Almighty. Clap for God. The louder you clap, the longer you live. And if you make noise while you're clapping, you make so much money in this year. If you think it's a lie, try it. You didn't know that I can control you people. The way I control DJ. Now all of you are under my control. Am I not the commando? Okay, you from where are you from? Kampala. But what is your name? Why are you speaking your language with an American accent? I don't understand. No, really. Just because you traveled for two weeks, we can't hear. Two weeks, just two weeks. You just came out and you are now shouting, Kubare, Kubare, Urukulumba, Kimbar, Year, Thunder Fire. You. We have a man who is a girl, but is a man that says he's a girl, but he doesn't know whether he should remain a girl because he's dressing like a girl, but he's a man and he says that you should call him a girl, but he has a girlfriend as a man. Do you even understand what I'm trying to say? <laughs> Did you hear that snake swallowed money in Nigeria? Snake. You think it's a lie? Google it. To the extent that when the news entered Google, Google shouted, God forbid. <laughs> there is a tribe in, in Nigeria. That tribe, anywhere you go, they are there. Everywhere I know they are here, whether you like it or not. Those people, no matter what, they go everywhere. Wait, let me find out. Ibokwenu! You people choose chose a corner. Ibokwenu! They are here. Those people, the way they love money. Ibo people in Nigeria, the way they love money. Ibo man will be counting money. You cannot distract him. You talk to him. He'll include you in the money he's, he's counting. <laughs> he'll include you. You'll be involved. You'll feel like, let me show you. 
Igbo man is standing, is counting money, and you're there talking to him. He's counting one, two, three, four. You greet him. Five, six. Good afternoon, sir. Seven, oh, my brother. Seven. Seven, oh, seven, seven. seven. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. How's the family? Fourteen, oh. Fourteen. 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 Fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen. I'm going, oh. Twenty, yeah? Twenty. Twenty. Twenty-one, twenty-two. They don't give it down. Please, ladies and gentlemen, I want to, I want to lay an advice. For all the people that... You love Nigerian songs, don't you? For all the people that like Nigerian songs, please be careful. These people don't sing anything useful. Please, what do you mean? By singing a song and you say, No, be you, I carry come. But now you are go carry go. Are you a kidnapper? <laughs> Someone like Flavor. Everybody loved Flavor's music. Imagine that they told Flavor, Come and write what you were singing. Write it down, let us see. What will flavor write? You'll come back and you'll be writing. Okay. Borokoto. Boom, boom. Borokoto. Boom, boom. Bakoroba. 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 Boom, boom. Ajori Popo. Ukuma baby. Achugurege. Boom, boom. Asawo. Awosha. Awosha. Asawo. Asawo. Awosha. Boom, boom. Eh, eh, eh. How do you spell eh? What is the spelling of eh, please? <laughs> Even David o, I'm looking for a sister. Show me my lover. Your sister is your lover. Is that not incest? <laughs> Committing incest. I don't understand. Let me ask you. Do you know any Nigerian dance step? Anyone? Tell me the name of the dance step. Let me tell you the origin of the dance step. Shoki. Shoki dance step was originated from a beggar. Shut up. I said musician. I said dance step, not musician. Dance step. Is Olamide is a musician or the dancer? Olamide, Olamide. I couldn't even hear what you are saying. It's my thought that I'm using to see Olamide, Olamide all over the air. Who said Jeremy? Who is that? Over there, please security help him. Security, I'm telling you, this guy will bite somebody here. Yeah. I can't even hear you. Were you were you formally deaf and drunk? Because you're why I'm hearing you like it's like they didn't cure you well. Speak up, let us hear. Give you the mic from here. It's like your eyes, like a binoculars. It's like you see yourself in front. You know, you people, you have, we call it Juju. You have, you have Juju here. Do you have Juju here? No, there's only one I know that you people have and you have it very strong. The one that if your wife goes to meet another man, the two of them become one. I know that one. You people have it and nobody can take it from Uganda. I'm telling you. My people are the only people that mother English language. We kill English. We don't care. When we travel out for two days like that man, where is he? He has run away. When we travel out for two days and we come back, anywhere we go to, we come back with American accent. Yo, I just came back, man. Shit. The police in Nigeria, they are slap. When they slap you, your anger that you're using to shout at them will first die down. Then you go into explanation that they did not ask you for. You might be there shouting at Nigerian police. What's wrong with you? Are you okay? Do you know who I am? If I deal with you, tell why. Officer. <sighs> you would have just asked me where I'm coming from. Because I was, I, I went, to, I, you, see, you see that my friend, me and him, we were coming from, do you see where we are coming from? He hasn't asked you anything, but you're explaining. <laughs> 
But the worst, you know, the Mopo, mobile police, those ones are like the American SWAT team. SWAT team. Those ones, they don't look at you. Their uniform is different. When they slap you, you don't... The, the, the voice you were using to shout initially will not be the voice you used to explain. Your voice will change. You don't have time to calm down. You just go straight into a, an explanation with another voice. You are there telling the police, what's wrong with you? Are you okay? Do you know who I am? I'll deal with you. That why. <laughs> I was coming from that side that time. I want, I want, I want, I want, and when I was coming, me and me and my, me and my friend, me and my friend, when we were, when we were coming, did I see you? Did you see me? Did we see we? Did us see us? Did I see I? I am a. When Nigerian army slap you, you know that the police is your friend. When they slap you, you don't explain to them, you explain to other people. <laughs> and as you're busy explaining to other people, they'll call you back and ask you, what happened? The explanation you give, believe me, even you will not understand it. <laughs> Nigerian army is standing here, you're shouting, my friend, what's your problem? Are you okay? You, do you know who I am? Do you know why I can tawai, 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 tawai? It's one slap. It's one slap. But the echo of the slap will continue. If you leave that place and come back one month later, stand at the same spot, you hear the echo of the slap will come and pass that place again. Tawai, 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 tawai. And immediately after the slap, they slapped your face, but your reaction will be like this. <laughs> and then you go to him, this is what you see. <laughs> see, you people saw me when I was coming that time. Did you see me? Did you not see me when I was coming? The man will call you. Hey, my friend, come here. You turn me? <laughs> no, your father. Come here. Okay. Out of safety, you move only one step. I'm here. I will now ask you, so what happened? Hmm? I say, what happened? Okay, sorry, sir. See, sir. When Sadi Saboy, sir, was sir, coming, sir, from sir, that's a sir, sir. I said, this, sir, no, sir, no, sir, what, sir, honestly, sir, that happened, sir. Sorry, sir. You are already apologizing. This thing I'm saying now, it will go to the internet. Then I'll go back to Nigeria. Then the police will say, what did you say about us in Uganda? <laughs> Camera, face me. The police in Nigeria are the best. <laughs> they are so good. I love them. They are my friends. The only, the, people, the only people in this life I fear their slap is my parents. When I was small, my father can slap for Africa. <laughs> Sometimes my father will slap you from one language to another and slap you back to the previous language you were using. Did you jump the fence? Daddy, that is not like... Did you jump the fence? That is, see, it's my friend that was doing birthday. So I decided to tawa Kanje, Kamma na magafu, if I name a bar. So Kanje say, Mfu no wari ene me, Kamma batazi ama fence. Tawa, that was when you came back. And I now saw you in the, I didn't even know I was switching language. My mother will slap you and tell you to do the opposite of what you are meant to do as a child. When they slap a child, what would the child do? You cry. My mother will tell you to do the opposite. So, you touch that thing without telling me. Mommy, it's not like I... Ah! <laughs> if I hear fame, at that point, you want to hold the cry. But the cry is coming. You're holding it. It's coming. You're holding up and down movements. You'll be sounding like the engine of a car that has plug problem. 
You're holding it. The thing is just bumping up and down. Tears will be flowing. That one, there's no control of that one. Tears will be flowing. He'll tell you, don't, don't, don't. It's so painful. And at that point, she will now look at you, seeing all the tears. You know, as a lady, she will look at you. Oh, yeah, okay, come, come. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Believe me, when you're in that plug problem condition, you don't need to hear the, the, that sorry. You don't need to hear it. Because once you hear it, the second plug will now have a problem. Then the sound will increase from hmm, 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 hmm. sorry, sorry, sorry. And then she now say, okay, do you know what? Just tell me what happened. Why did you go there? Why? Just tell me. Tell me I'm your mother. Now you want to explain. Let me tell you something. In that condition, you can never explain anything. Because you won't understand what you're saying. She won't understand what you're saying. Even God will not understand what you're saying. Because that volcano must erupt. You see that cry? Once you try to talk, it must come out. So once he says, okay, tell me what happened. You'll now go, I, I, want, I want to, I, I just, was working, I'm going, in order to get, it wasn't that. You must cry that cry. I'm telling you. So, I was talking about our dance. The origin of all our dance. If you love shaku shaku dance step, raise your hand. If you danced it, raise your hand. Yes, the criminal's hands are up. These are all the criminals. Because that dance step is from a criminal that was caught somewhere stealing. And the man ran away. The police pursued him. The market people chased him. So police and market people combined pursue and chase that as they purchase him. As they purchase him, the guy was running. He got to a place. The road, one road here, one road here. He didn't know what to go to, where to go to. He looked here, looked here. He said, these people, they'll come. They'll catch me, handcuff me. I can't escape. Where do I run to? Do I go here? Do I go there? Do I go here? Do I go there? <laughs> Is that not the dance step? Which other one? Alex. Yeah. Please come up. I want to I want to say something about this man. When he called me to come for this program, I was excited. First of all, thank you very much for making sure it was one there that brought me here. Wait, are they here? One there? <laughs> Members of Ru Rwanda Airline. Rwanda, you... Rwanda, where are you? Good to have you. These guys have aircraft. aircraft. Yes, in my country, we have witchcraft. <laughs> Nigeria Airways used to fly, then witchcraft took over. <laughs> so, aircraft is no more available. You know our movies? Yeah. I, when it comes to movies, I watch your movie here. Yeah. Yes. I watch Uganda movie. Please put your hands together for yourselves, please. I watch your movie. Well, how different was it? Just, the... Your movies are still better than our own. Yeah, a round of applause. You know yes, why? Uh, why? It's only Nigeria movie that we combine God and devil <laughs> to fight for us. Because I saw a juju priest uh -huh. shouting uh -huh. in the Nigeria movie, yeah. calling on the name of the gods. Amadioha, Amadioha, answer me for Christ's sake. <laughs> Honestly, I, I saw a ghost in a Nigerian movie. The ghost came out and went to the person's house and knocked. <laughs> when the person saw the ghost and ran, the ghost ran after the person. The person jumped on a border border and then the ghost stopped and was like, <sighs> Hey, and I don't have any money on me here. Yeah. <laughs> Do you know Ugandan girls are wonderful? Honestly, all of you. Yeah. All Ugandan girls, beautiful set of people. See them. Yeah. Fine, natural, 
room makeup. Even the ones that are made up very light. Yeah. Nigerian girls. After making up, sometimes they use chisel and hammer. To, rem to remove what they have imbibed on their face. <laughs> when they come for comedy show, they don't laugh. Yeah. They go, <laughs> <laughs> you know why? They laugh like this. <laughs> to be like thunder, like lightning all over their face. The thing will tear, crack. Some girls, yeah. some girls in Nigeria, you remove the makeup on their face, you can use it to paint two houses. <laughs> <laughs>